Hey there, viewers! We all want a good night's sleep, but we often forget about one of the determining factors in a good night's sleep – the quality of our mattress. A good mattress helps us relax, decreasing our level of physical and mental stress. At least, the right mattress does. Let's talk about whether your mattress is right for you. Does it help your spine? Does it help you sleep better? Does it set off your allergies? We're talking all that and more. Let's begin! Number 1. It helps you de-stress most of us work 9 to 5. For many, that 8 hours is spent sitting at a desk, staring at a laptop. While it may be crucial to your job, it's not the healthiest routine. After returning home, you want proper rest. This way you feel recharged the next day. This is where a good mattress is important. Even in a study, it was found that a good mattress usually helps people get better sleep and reduce the stress hormones in their body. Additionally, the comfort factor plays a major role in this. When you lay on a comfortable mattress, your brain produces serotonin. This helps you stay in a good mood. Number 2. It helps you sleep better This is mainly because it makes you feel comfortable. During this process, your pineal glands begin to release melatonin. Now you might be wondering, what is melatonin? To put it simply, it's a hormone that controls your sleep-wake cycle. Usually, the melatonin release in your body starts spiking from 9pm onwards. By the time 9 a.m. rolls around, the release lowers. This allows you to work more efficiently. We've spoken in detail about melatonin in our video, 11 Vitamins and Supplements You Should Take for Stress Relief. Make sure you check it out, it'll help you gain more information on the hormone. So are you enjoying this video? Make sure to click the subscribe button and ring that notification bell, that way you won't miss out on our latest content. Now let's get back to the video. Number 3. Helps with your spinal alignment a lot of you suffer from chronic back pain. Your mattress may have something to do with it. A mattress is supposed to help you sleep better. In order to do that, its weight distribution needs to be evenly balanced. In one study, patients with chronic lower back pain between 18 and 60 years old were asked to sleep on a mattress with equal weight on all sides. Subjects ended up getting more sleep than usual. They also complained less about their chronic pain. Fascinating, don't you think? This happened because an evenly balanced bed will improve your spinal alignment. Alright, now that we've noted important reasons for a good mattress, let's focus on actually getting the mattress next. Number 1. How it feels A good mattress is supposed to make you want to sleep. It's more important you buy a mattress made from soft fabric. This is more likely to make you feel comfortable and your body will feel good every time you come in contact with this fabric. In order to get proper sleep, you need this feeling. Number 2. Density and Thickness of the Foam Remember equal distribution of weight? For this to work properly, you need to check the density and thickness of its foam. This is usually an important factor in deciding how comfortable or bouncy a mattress will be. Usually mattresses with bigger foams are lighter in weight. More importantly, they're usually the ones that are more comfortable. Number 3. How you sleep People like to sleep in different ways, to each their own. Some people like to sleep on either their left or right side, others snooze on their back or on their belly. This is why your mattress should cater to your needs. If you like to sleep on your side, you can either go with a soft foam mattress or one with inner springs. They have built-in pressure relief points that can help your shoulders and your hips. If you're a stomach sleeper, a soft foam mattress is definitely a no, as it may envelop your nasal area, making it difficult for you to breathe. Instead, something like a firm foam mattress or an air-filled one would be the most ideal. As for the ones who like to sleep on their back, you'll be able to adjust your mattress. Number 4. Do you toss? When buying a mattress, you need to ask yourself, do I toss and turn? If the answer is yes, we would suggest you buying a comfortable inner springs mattress or a dual chamber air-filled one. Both these mattresses are known for their ability to reduce the vibration caused by your movements. This ensures you get a good night's sleep, despite all the antics. Avoid firm beds as a little bit of movement could cause you to wake up. Number 5. Do you have allergies? People have different allergies. This is why it's important that your bed is resistant to those allergens. This could help you get a good night's sleep and stay healthy at the same time. Since both foam and latex have antimicrobial properties, they seem like automatic choices. Number 6. For back pain 
We've already discussed how your back can be helped with the right mattress. Well, if you're going through chronic back pain, we wouldn't suggest you go with Airfield or Inner Springs mattresses. Instead, something like a soft foam mattress or latex would be better. Number seven, do you sleep heavy? The way you sleep also matters when you're looking to buy a mattress. Usually those who are heavier sleepers need to have a heavier mattress. Similarly, those who like to sleep a little light can opt for a lighter mattress. It all depends on the way you like to sleep. Now it's time to discuss the size of the mattress. Yes, mattresses come in various sizes. Let's explore them. Number one, queen size. Probably one of the most well-known mattresses, it is spacious enough to fit two people. More importantly, queen-size mattresses are very cost-effective. This means you can get a decent mattress without paying too much money. So if your wallet's a little tight, no need to worry. Number two, king size. If a queen size isn't good enough, king size is your next best option. It's good for couples who might want some extra space while sleeping. More importantly, it can be used by both heavy and light sleepers. This is mostly because of the extra space it comes with. Of course, the type of foam or latex also matters. On the upside, you'll have plenty of space. Come to think of it, even people who toss and turn while sleeping find this more useful. Number three, California King. Imagine king size, but slightly more narrow and long. This is a California King, basically the same as a king size mattress. The only difference is that it isn't necessarily made for couples. Instead, it's made for tall people who find it hard to sleep in regular mattresses. Number four, full or double. If you have to have a mattress specifically meant for couples, you're looking at a full mattress. This type is also good for heavy sleepers, children, and teenagers. Number five, twin. Twins are often the smallest size of mattress available. They're also the most cost-effective of beds. It's usually used by adults who prefer to live on their own, or kids. Since the bed is lightweight, it's also easy to carry. So what type of mattress do you have? Do you think you've picked your mattress wisely? Let us know in the comments. We would love to hear from you. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait, what kind of Bestie are we if we don't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left or right video, and enjoy.